Hi again everyone. Unfortunately I had to put off the videos I planned because we were getting a lot of persistent rain and wind and my yard is a mess. So in this video I'm going to be giving my opinion on exercising young large breed dogs instead and I'm going to start with the young puppies. But before I get to that I want to thank everyone who has supported our channel by subscribing, hitting the like button and dropping us a comment. The engagement really helps us with the YouTube algorithm and I want to give you a big thanks for that. So thank you everyone. Okay, on to the puppies. I let young puppies play because they are pretty good at self-regulating their own activity levels between naps. Young dogs will often settle down chewing on toys or whatever they can make into one without ever overexerting themselves. If they are playing and messing around with other dogs, that's another story. And what I watch for is when they begin taking frequent little breaks to catch their breath and then I will separate them and allow them to continue on by themselves. Early play helps develop the muscle tone needed to give support to the rapidly growing frame. Too little exercise can be as bad for young dogs as them getting too much. One of the most important things for the young dogs is to keep them lean as they grow, because there's less chance of doing damage to the joints. Good muscle tone and less excess weight gives more wiggle room when it comes to exercise time and intensity. If you keep the dogs lean to where you can see the last couple of ribs and they have a tuck up at the belly, you should see the effects you're having on the dog's muscles. If there is no tone there, they are probably not getting enough exercise to help support the frame. The dog doesn't have to be ripped, but if you're in the right ballpark, there should be some definition to the muscles. If I'd be using the dog's walk as the main exercise for the day, meaning they spend little time playing and are not being trained, I'd start with a baseline of 5 minutes per month of age twice per day until they were 6 to 7 months old. After that, if I wanted to transition to a once per day walk, I'd do it over a bit of time like a week instead of just jumping into a single walk. That would be the baseline I would use and I would absolutely adjust that to what I am seeing in the condition of the dog. As always, thanks for watching and please like, subscribe and share.